Put it in barrels, gets better with age, and you might want to sit. Zach and, it, Zach and Colton, they're on their way up on the bus. Uh, oh! I love it! Oh, oh Kill, kill, kill. So if you hunt the buckeye state, you have to take a buckeye with you. So I'm going to take it with you. Knock them down, you can't show them what you're made of. Be proud of anything you got. I don't even know how many points she's got. They're everywhere. <laughs> they're everywhere. <laughs>
on this order tomorrow. Yeah, let's yeah. <laughs> I don't think it'll last more than 30. We don't have a lot of deer killed hard for them, but it, I mean. So, I mean, if that gives you a reference as far as size wise. Okay. So, um, which the thing he doesn't have is much mass. Yeah. So, he's got good main beam, good tie length, but just that mass. Like that made me nervous. I thought that was. Oh, where's, where's my bow? Let's go. So that makes that's more nervous than being in front of thousands of people, huh? Oh my gosh, man. Oh my gosh. Of course, we're hunting in Ohio, the Buckeye State. I picked me a lucky Buckeye before I left Kentucky. Put that in my pocket. Jack's got one in his pocket. I said, if you're hunting the Buckeye State, you have to take a Buckeye with you. <laughs> that first, yeah, like, good. you got your cock and rope? Yeah. I felt like that night actually shot. I almost. <laughs> well, now I'm wondering. <laughs> now I'm wondering if I'm going to be able to see. Yeah. I'm excited. Let's kill us deer. Let's kill this week we're hunting in southern Ohio with Sunfish Valley Outfitters. There, there's monster deer here. There's no debating about that. Um, this year we're hunting a deer they call the Jenner Buck. It's a buck that never sheds his velvet. He does shed his antlers, but never his velvet. They've had pictures of him for five years. Never had daylight pictures of him until last year when they started feeding buck bourbon. It's actually one of the coolest stories you'll ever hear just because of this ancient buck. I mean, he's eight, nine years old. No daylight pictures till they started feeding 110. So that's just a testament to how good it works. But uh, they've been feeding 110 and our barrel proof this year and they actually started getting pretty consistent daylight pictures of him. So they wanted us to have a chance to hunt him just because you know we're making the stuff that brought him out in daylight. We're hunting this big, big bluff. It's a ridge that comes down off this mountaintop and goes all the way down to a bean field. These deer have been feeding in these bean fields at night, so we're just trying to catch them, you know, an hour or two before they actually get to the bean field. I'm not paid to say this, just my opinion. That's the best broadhead on the market. That's a 100 grain Schweiker. It's 30 yards to the farthest buck bourbon spot. should start moving around so hopefully fingers crossed in the next couple hours we'll see some movement.
Go down. He's freaking down. Oh my god. That was drawn up just like we wanted it to happen. Oh, I was sitting there regretting passing that night. I was I was regretting it. I was like, it's gonna bite me in the ass. It ain't gonna pan out. Oh, we had deer get downwind of us. That's the reason why I, I had to wait for him to turn just a little bit. He was feeding facing me the whole time, and I know there was deer downwind of us, and he was getting antsy because I think one of them was getting ready to blow. They just they weren't acting right behind us. Oh, I knew I could squeeze it right between those trees, make that shot at that distance. Ah, where'd he go? 80 yards. I don't even know how many points he's got. <laughs> they're, every, they're everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> oh my God. That nine, that nine pointer made a scrape right there. Like he was. I saw a bunch of flashes over here behind us, and yeah. I was like, something else is going on. Oh my God, man. The Jenner, that we call this the Jenner buck because it never sheds its velvet. We don't know if it's got balls. We don't know what's wrong with it. But he, did you see him making the scrape right there? I heard him. I couldn't. I said it's him. I, I said it's him because I could see, I could just see points going everywhere. Oh, that's why you hunt Ohio. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Whew. That was awesome. Don't have service. We can't call nobody and celebrate yet. Let me turn on my phone too. Oh, there you go. Holy crap. That thing's got 12 inch bases, Jack. really solid. Oh my goodness. That deer is ancient. Absolute ancient deer. They've been trying to kill him for five years. So, I mean this deer has got to be eight to ten years old I would think. Never sheds his velvet does shed his antlers and he's actually I think went downhill from all the pictures they posted uh, I mean good god thank you Jack <laughs> nice thank you bud holy crap I cannot believe it happened give you a little piece of advice. I wouldn't put anybody back in that stand to kill Jenner. Okay. Is he dead? He's dead. Are you serious? Oh, he's dead, bud. <laughs> he's dead. Heck yeah. He didn't go 80 yards. Sweet. Had to pass the nine up. I figured. Way you watch Oh my. See, I don't know how many points he's got. Like, I don't know. What in the crap is this? This is a freak. <laughs> it's the ugliest, coolest deer I've ever seen. <laughs> so, I mean, how do you even. How many hunters have you had that have actually seen him? One. 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 That's crazy. Hey. Thanks, brother. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Hey. Hey. I You're still, welcome. I think it was the power of the You're Buckeye. <laughs> hey look, it was the power hey, of the congratulations, Buckeye. Congratulations, congratulations. Power of the Buckeye.